Privet, Katila, ya niharasho, cause today I just realized that we are in a global recession. So I, um, I'm like, why the fuck is the GDP not rising? We implemented a bunch of programs to implement the GDP. But, uh, <clears throat> turns out the GDP, the world is fucked, is against Germany. It's those damn, you know what, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, it's not anything. But anyway, um, so, yeah, we we're year in and, uh, things aren't looking so hot. I mean, relatively speaking. So let's first of all figure out the Freedom of Information Act because they need the people want to know what types of orgies I have behind closed doors. Let's see. There have been calls for a law to increase the availability of information held on databases about citizens without their knowledge. These include the records held by private medical companies, insurance companies, and debt collection agencies, as well as information held by government departments. Uh, so propose it or reject it. Um. Uh, so here's the thing, we're, this is kind of, uh, should I go back to it? We'll get back to it. Fuck! Well, ain't this some shit. Okay, um, actually, never mind, we'll just, you know, so the thing is, is that we're a conservative government, and now this will help the liberals. Now, the thing is, we, we shouldn't, just because this is like a patriotic, nationalistic playthrough, that does not mean we have to, like, piss off the liberals at every single turn Ben Shapiro style. We need to... You know, pr you know, give them a bit of a, you know, oopsie doopsie thing. Um, you know, a, a bone so they don't assassinate me. Because what happened last time when we, as I said, the socialist playthrough, we got our ass handed to us, and well, by ass handed to us, we got a bullet to the brain. So, <laughs> by my high caliber sniper round. So we'll propose it, just to act, just to make the liberals not too pissed off. I mean, who the fuck gets pissed off by not having this? The socialists are liking us. Okay, so our deficit is up through the tubes. Let's increase the thing. Okay, we cannot. Okay, actually, before we do that, we're gonna imp reshuffle our cabinet. Yeah, all of you are work except you, the welfare guy, Felix Weber. I I like how this is Germany, and half these people on this are not German. Gregor Roth, Adam Paul, Vanessa Kuhn, Martin Schmitz, Royal Lords, and yeah. So, yeah. We have half non-Germans on a German cabinet that is unacceptable. We'll reshuffle it. So, foreign policy. That's really good, but she's kind of pissed off. A little bit pissed off, but conservatives and patriots are the ones who are like, that, what the fuck? What the hell? But I didn't... You absolute buffoon. God. Why transport? I was hiring for... Okay, so as I said before, you have to choose who your your core demographics that you're trying to appeal to is. So in this case, who's a good... For, and also, another thing is who is... Like, they, who they want? Like, it, what's the thing they want? Like, it, for example, if you're hiring for law... For, I don't know, let's say welfare. Don't hire this person because they don't want welfare. Now, the second thing is... that what The second thing they have to look for is who are, who, who are their sympathies? Because if they like, if you're, if you're making your, the core sympathies happy, they will be happy. They'll be like, yay, clowns. So anyway, yeah, so foreign policy, farmers and parents, those are people we want. I mean, essentially, most people would like, but farmers and parents are really good, especially parents. Next is welfare. Farmers and environmentalists. I mean, we're going to be environmentalists. I don't think we're going to trash the environment on purpose, especially when we grow the economy and things start going to shit. No, I think minorities aren't going to exist. I mean, we, we, hmm. welfare. Where's some welfare guys? Oh, parents, patriots? Hell yeah. Yeah, I love this guy. Thank you, Felix Weber. All right, economy. Who's a good economist? Religious capitalist? Religious conservative? That's pretty good. Just wanted to, just wanted to look for the op, op, oh, trade union's patriot and a good one to boot. Sure. Tax. Mmm, was a good tax person. Conservative farmers, that's awesome. Public services, do 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 Public services, liberal ca- Ah, uh, nah. Public services, what's a good public service person? Liberal parents, nah. What's a good public service person? We might have to look at others. Self-employed religious, eh. Public religious conservatives, maybe, fuck. Okay, hold up, can we like skip and like hire a law and order person? Okay. 
What's a law and order person? What's a law and order person? Because remember, our big thing is law and order. Law and order. Law and order. Okay. I don't think anyone has law and order. Is trade union a socialist person? I mean, we're not trade unionists. Uh, I don't know. Socialist. Uh, I mean, socialists are getting pretty happy. What else? Okay, but law and order. Who's a law and order person? Religious conservative. Uh. I just want to look at liberals, ethnic minorities. Yeah, like we're gonna hire you, Nikos Clean. Uh, there is no law and order at all. All right, who? What's the okay? What's the least evil? What's the least bad one? Religious conservatives, sure. Right, but the, eh. let's hire you for public services instead. Religious conservative person, law and order. Next, you are. Law and order. What's in law and order? Yeah, the thing is, oh yeah, so I'm right now eating uh, kasha. Now you might mind what the fuck is a kasha. A kasha, mean, I think, in English, is uh, oatmeal. I think. Yeah, oatmeal. And uh, I, I, I love kasha. You know, sometimes it's good. Sometimes it's, uh, there's some sort of fucking worm in... Oh jeez, I, I... Do you ever get that time in your nose when you feel like you're gonna, like... It, your, your nose just like flares up and you feel like you're gonna sneeze but you don't you're not like sneezing yeah I do too there's no law and order person we are pi Jesus law and order we are literally hiring anyone fine fine okay we wasted our money what's a good thing we could do what is a good thing let's implement Let's implement free. No, let's, what's our? What are some things we want? What are some things that we could get that are good? Ooh. Oh yeah, small business grants. This is another thing we could do to help our brethren out. And I know it costs a lot, but let's let's go to five fifty. Five fifty two. The failure rate is only high. So this is another way to increase the GDP by 4%. Socialism gets annihilated, so does the trade unionists and the self-employed. Well, well, fuck me. I mean, this, I, nah, that's pretty much all right. Good for our first term. That's not, here's the thing with the GDP. In this game, if you get the GDP up, you get more money, no matter if. Yes, I know, we will conquer that soon. Okay, we need to increase the taxes right now. Okay, how much... Okay. We are in a $90 billion deficit. 115. That's like only 30... Oh my god, we... My ass is grass. Well, that's the most we could do at the moment. Literally, we just raised taxes. That might piss off some people. Alright, next turn. I mean, that's all we could do. Pay raise taxes. Because, you know, we, we have no political capital to work with. We need... Oh, at least the doc... Fuck. We just increased the goddamn military. God damn it. Well, at least the deficit went down to 60 billion. What's next? What's something we could make people happy with? Patri oh, yeah, Patriots just don't like that. Uh... Ooh. I like this. Citizenship test. But first, actually, what we're gonna do, as conserv- this is something that I make the conservatives awesome. What actually, there's probably a few other things we could do that are- Actually, yeah, this is gonna help make the conservatives and the religious happy. We hired a bunch of conservatives, so we're not just patriots, we are conservative nationalists. So, national conservatives. So what is- this is a tax break for married couples. Basically, if- if you're married, we are helping you. We we are promoting traditional family values, a traditional way of life, and we need that. Also, another thing, liberalism goes down. We're trying to get more conservatives. Parents and parents love it too. It's an incentive. It's awesome. That should help. Another thing we're gonna do is. What are some things we're gonna do? What? Let's do an alcohol awareness campaign to crack down on the alcohol consumption because we don't want people drunk on the streets. Yeah, that's the thing. In in our great Deutschland, we shall crack down. I know it's like, well, it's Germany. Why the hell are you, you know, cracking down? 
Oh wait, oh, fuck me. I need to increase the intelligence services a little bit. I also need to get rid of those too. How much ethnic minorities? There's. Hey, hey, we got rid of uh, one group of people. Now how many patriots are there? There's still only seven. We need something else. Damn it. This is the third time, so next time's our last thing. All right. How about this? Okay, that's going down. Poverty. There is one thing that we could do to crack down on poverty also, but there's probably not at this moment. All right. Let's go to the next thing. Let's figure this out. Let's see. So last year, and this is the last time of our second year, we are going to do some things. I know it's a grim, I know. At least we got rid of the doctor strike. That is what it matters. Oh, God, my ass. We're gonna... Mmm. <coughs> ah. Mm -mm. I need to pump those GDP numbers up, my dude. Okay, what's next? What are some other things we could do? This increases liberalism membership. So we're gonna... I'm gonna I'm gonna sell this to the public in a little bit of a, in a you know very awesome way. Actually, you know what? We're gonna do that next time. What we're gonna do this time is implement a national anthem in schools. Our citizens will. What is the German anthem anyway? Isn't it like illegal, or didn't they change it or something like that? Like our. Uh, I'm not gonna sing. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna kill your ears by li making you listen to my things. I'm I'm, I'm gonna spare you at that. Young people these days have lost all sense of belonging. Starting the day in school with the national anthem will lose their national pride and help disciplining them. This will not, they will not, may not look like, but they would be good for them. I agree. And the reason why is because we increased Patriot membership by 9%. And the youth might not like it, but they'll like it. And the next thing, now here's another thing. We're going to implement free school meals. Now I think this will make the youth happy. Look, you're going to listen to the national anthem, right? You're going to become patriotic German, the German military youth. I know, I know that that might bring some references back to the 30s, but you know, we're we're good, we're good. And then we're gonna have free now. In in response, we're gonna have free school meals. Now, why am I saying? As not only as a compromise, because this takes out obesity and it makes you know the parents happy and the socialists a little happy, but it destroys poverty as well. Now, there's one more thing that I wanted, but I think we don't have enough to do it. Yeah, we don't. Yeah, that's it. And God damn it! Uh, well, shit. Well, next, that's pretty good for right now. I um, oh, is, oh, is OBC going away? Yeah, it is. No more fat people in, in Germany. This is collapsed. That's good. That's good. But we need to get rid of that poverty. Yeah. So that that should address it soon. Our expenditure start going up again. God, our interest is. Ooh, this is... We are not going good. We are not... Ugh, ugh. Okay, the global economy is kind of going back up a little bit. It should start in... Where's the GDP at? Where are the GDP at? Where are the GDP at? Okay, see, it was going down, and now it's slowly going up again. It's because of the global economy. Yeah, I think the prostitution got, like, these two things. I think it was the prostitution, but hey, we're not having prostitutes on our streets. We need some other things that help the GDP. But what exactly is that? I have no clue. Yeah, I don't know. So well, what are we going to do next? So there's a few things. First of all, we're going to get rid of this race discrimination act. We're going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to package it to the voters in one thing. I'm going to package it in a, in, a, in, a, in a way that they'll like, they'll like it. And uh, I, I, you guys will see that next video. Um, what are some other things we're going to do? We're going to continue combating crime. But not sure. I, I think we're also going to implement a uh, uh, more increase in security, just in case people want to kill us. What are some things we want? We want to ban porn. We want to ban extreme porn. So we'll implement internet censorship soon. Maybe not soon, but like maybe next time if we if we get reelected. That is. Oh shit! Why, why haven't I had the flags on every street corner? Definitely having hoisting those German flags. Yeah. Here, we're going to have a space program to get this Patreon membership up, the Rural Development Grants, uh, you know, obviously. This, I think we're going to have the Welfare Fraud Department that we want, Citizenship Chest for this one, and probably National Service. Transport, we're going to have our own National Monorail System, a few other things. Public Services, um, 
you know, here's the here's the weird thing about art subsidies is that they increase liberal me liberalism membership, but I would still do it if I was like a nationalistic government. But real art, not like the shitty uh, like oh, let me smear shit on the wall, and that's art. No, not no, real art. And for here, I might get a mortgage tax relief thing. That might be what one thing I want. Maybe a carbon tax. Maybe, maybe. I'm thinking if uh, if I'm I'm wondering if we're gonna go environmentals. Maybe I'm not sure. But we shall figure that out soon. How are the conservatives are liking us more? How about crime? How's crime going? Yeah, we need stronger crime. Alrighty. So that is it. So uh, yeah, hopefully we continue. We are two years in. We are halfway through our term, right? Yeah. Nine turns, right? So it'll be nine eighteen, right? Yep. Yeah. So, yep, I'll see you guys next time in the next theater in the glorious, patriotic, nationalistic Germany. So aim high, wander on from America with Russian love.